All right, welcome back to RD Cycles channel. Welcome back to RD Cycles. Uh, ngayon, uh, share ko lang sa inyo yung experience ko na sumali ako sa my, my first face-to-face -face event uh, and my first gravid race ever. Uh, so, um, just to give you a background, this is the second gravel race in the Philippines. Uh, first was two months ago, yung UCI uh, World, gravel, uh, World Gravel Race. Uh, na ginawa sa Bungabon. Uh, gravel racing is so much fun. Uh, ganda ng course ito. You will see later on. Okay. So, uh, nakakatuwa kasi ang daming new faces. Uh, I say new faces kasi sobrang tagal ko nang sumasali sa mga outdoor events simula pa ng panahon ng mga dinosaur. Ganun na ako kapananda. And uh, daming newbies. Uh, nakakatuwa kasi they're out with their friends. They're not stuck at home. Uh, sticking to playing with their gadgets or playing online so nakakatawa na encourage ako kasi yung mga tao outdoors so halo-halong muka halo-halong mga tao uh, all starting on equal ground on the same ground tapos may, of course meron ka pa rin yung mga uh, seasoned bikers na sumali so complete with gear and uh, hydration pack gels etc so yun nakakatawa kasi sama-sama sila and again Sobrang ganda ng course. Sa sobrang ganda ng course, I regret not bringing a uh, body camera or GoPro or stopping to take enough pictures. So, yun yung mga konting, very few snippets that I had dun sa gravel event. So, it, sobrang ganda ng course kasi akala mo hindi siya, uh, akala ng iba hindi siya challenging. Pero it was just in just enough hurt and it at just the right distance uh, especially for me na hindi pa nababalik hindi pa nakabalik yung fitness level ko doon uh, but you will see dito sa gradient alone pa lang from my IGP sport na IG630 uh ito makikita mo 23% of the whole course was the only flat road so ibig sabihin 77% of the time you were either climbing up or going down so yun yung uh, yun yung course tapos for this specific course so uh, I feeling ko no uh, I think I registered my highest uh, heart rate uh, dito na zone so umabot ako hanggang uh, zone 3 which is 151 so sobrang yun yung exactong uh, heart rate ko uh, going back to the course so this was a in my opinion the a, a gravel category is a mountain biker's race to lose. Not specifically using a mountain bike, but if you have a mountain biking discipline, uh, sobrang, this is right up your alley. Uh, this is an XC marathon without the technical single tracks. So yun yung assessment ko, at least pertaining to this specific event. And speaking of gravel events, feeling ko uh, in my, my fearless forecast is for the first year or the first two years, yan, yan lang yung timeline or time frame na i-allow nila ang mga mountain bike makasali. Uh, given, given, the, given the period of time, feeling ko on the third year ng gravel racing, once this really explodes and it will, believe me, gravel event will explode. And once it does, uh, yun, um, asahan nyo, implement na nila yung rules na dapat naka-gravel bike ka dito. Ano specifically ang definition ng gravel bike? Kanya-kanyang event yan, I believe. So, um, yung iba dyan, siguro dapat gravel bike siya by description of the brand right away. Um, hindi natin alam kung makakalusot yung mga assembled gravel bikes or mountain bike na converted to gravel or road bikes na converted to gravel. We don't know. So, depende sa organizer and their, kung depende yan sa rules na iseset nila sa inyo. Uh, sa atin, sa lahat ng participants eventually. Pero this specific course, sobrang kung mauulit tong course na to, I would, uh, I would like to try it again using my own mountain bike kasi ang ginamit ko lang dito, demo bike. So, uh, speaking of demo bike, papakita ko sa inyo mamaya ako ano yun. But, dahil ang ginamit ko dito, demo bike, of course, nandoon yung Sobrang ingat kasi kailangan mo ibalik. Kailangan ko ibalik yung demo bike in pristine condition. So, speaking of demo bike, uh, ito yung ginamit natin na demo bike. I was fortunate enough na magamit ko yung Cannondale Topstone Carbon Lefty 3. 
So it's a full suspension gravel bike. Wide handlebars. Na appreciate ko yung uh, para sandblast or matte finish ng GRX na shifters. Very good contact point. Walang slippage. Ganda yung grip dun sa levers. Tapos uh, full carbon bike siya. Na appreciate ko na carbon siya. Kasi magaan yung bike itulak or i-bike pa akyat. It has a patent and lefty Oliver na fork with 30 millimeters travel which is sobrang sakto lang. It ate all the bumps. Kahit na gano'n siya ka-aggressive, walang problema. Full confidence with a, a lefty Oliver fork. I was uh, iffy doon sa rear wheel kasi yung uh, rear wheel was very smooth and slick sa center. Pero I was surprised it held its own kahit ano yung terrain except for the wet uh, river crossings. Yun talaga madulas kahit anong gawin mo. Uh, depende na lang sa your, your sense of balance mo. But um, GRX uh, group set, sobrang panalo yung shifting. I would attribute it, I would uh, compare it even to Ultegra shifting. Ganun ka smooth ang uh, GRX 800 and 600 na combination. Tapos yun, kita niyo yung lahar, ipon. Um, I, I tried my best na sobrang ingatan yung bike, pero ganun talaga, it's gravel racing. So, madudumihan at madudumihan ka talaga. So, yun, it was really nice to see everyone out and about. And again, kung pwede, lang, kung pwede ko siyang i-bike ulit again, well, i- i- different event, pero same course, uh, definitely babalikan ko sana. Uh, and definitely, sasali ulit ako kung meron pa ulit. Uh, gravel event racing kasi it's it's perfect for I find it perfect for me na tinatry ko palang ibalik yung fitness level ko it's perfect for people na who get bored sa road bikes or ayo or anti-road bikes sila so perfect yung gravel racing para sa kanila kasi it's sila yung mga renegade sila yung mga ayo ng sobrang serious na uh, cycling gear or cycling kit yung suot Tapos perfect din ito for mountain bikers na naghahanap ng iba which is a more relaxed or ano, more relaxed pace or more relaxed uh, terrain. So perfect yun. Mala, mala, malawak yung market na ina-attract ng gravel bike. And I'm very excited and very sure puputok tong category na to sa Philippine market. And um, sana, sana more gravel events to come. So yun. Congratulations sa inyong lahat. Congratulations sa lahat ng mga sumali. And if you think this video was helpful, please do like, share, and subscribe. If you're interested in any of the products featured here, like your bike or your IGS 630, ayun, uh, please go to our website in the description section below. And yun, uh, support the channel by purchasing these items. All right, salamat.